Hey YouTube, this is Pokecast XVII here, and uh, yeah, as promised, I have the new Forces of Nature collection box, which literally just came out today. Um, I thought it was going to come out a lot sooner than it actually did, but uh, today is when it came out, and I managed to get hold of it. And I guess what particularly sold it to me was the uh, the Full Art Landorus, which looks really cool, and you get alternate artworks in there for the other genies as well. And actually, all three of them are really playable cards. So um, yeah, let's just get straight to opening it. So. Um, I haven't got a knife, probably should have come a bit more prepared, but uh, oh well. Okay. Alright guys, so this is the opening of the box. Just go through, try and get this plastic off. Okay, so here is the full outlandrous, when I get it out. Okay. Okay, so that is definitely a really nice looking card actually. I'll just show you guys in the camera if you can see. Follow up. There we go. So there it is. And yep, you also get three packs, which I guess my only real complaint is that you get Emergent Powers and Cool Legends, which um, there's nothing really I need from those sets, but uh, let's get the Thunderous and Tornadoes out. Okay, so show you these guys as well. So they're really nice looking cards, they're in reverse hollow as well, um, not to get them confused with the hollows. So there you go, those are the three genies and uh, yeah, might as well start opening the packs and see what we get. So um, I'll start with the cool legends first, maybe a Pachirisu would be nice, I can't really think of anything else that I would need. Okay, so no codes with these ones, let's go through. Okay, a Tangler and a Ninetales, uh, I guess Ninetales is pretty nice. Got a hollow in a pack, which is good. Okay, so I shove those out. Um, Professor Oak, maybe. Lime Junior. Okay, so I'll keep those out because I guess they're the more playable stuff. Okay, so my first Emerging Powers pack. Okay, so take the code out this one. And we have in here. Okay, a Bianca, that's not too bad because I know they're actually starting to become a bit more playable. And uh, some reverse hollow. I usually collect the uh, reverse hollows and trainers and supporters. Okay, and my last emergent powers pack. Okay, so the last pack for this. And we have a Swadloon. Oh, <laughs> nice, a Thunderous. Cool. And a Spooster copy as well. So, yeah, in all, not too bad. Okay, so just a quick recap. So you get okay. So the Fallout Landorus, uh, Thunderous, and Tornadus, both in Reverse Hollow, and then you get a couple of packs as well. You get two Emergent Powers and a Call of um, Call of Legends, and in Emergent Powers, I've got a Thunderous, uh, Bianca, Swadloon, which I guess are the more playable stuff. That um, well, Swadloon's not that playable, but the Thunderous and Tornadus are definitely cool. Um, Thunderous and uh, Bianca even. And in the Cool Legends I pulled uh, Ninetales, a Tangler, and I've just kept these two aside in case, um, I don't know, maybe I might use them in the future. I know Oaks are collectible at the moment because they're really playable. So, um, yeah, so uh, there you have it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I will see you soon.